Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Jay Flight, and today I'm going to be doing a room tour. Although I probably should have made my room a bit cleaner before I did this, I now realize that. But, anyways, I don't really know how to start this off. So, I'm just going to show you guys my wall first. So, that's my katanas. If you guys have seen my live streams, then you guys have definitely seen them. But they're pretty dope. Um, they're really not sharp or anything, which sucks. But I don't really need them to be. I'm, not, I'm retired from the samurai business, and then that's all my pop figures. They're 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 pretty cool, and I got that one for like three dollars, or actually my mom did, and yeah, I really like them. Here, it's a slot machine. Let's see. Damn, but one time it might be on this slot machine. Well, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's on this slot machine, but my friend bet me that I couldn't get three sevens in a row because, like, it's like fucking difficult. And then I just spun it once and I got it on my first try. It was badass. That's actually more of a pancake that bet me that. So go check out his thing in the top right right now and link down in the description and on the YouTube bank card. Wow, here's a little I don't even know the things, the little mini games that you plug into like TVs. Here's my thing from PAX, and a little monkey from, I think the Marin. There's lots of those too. Here's a dog Trump candy, or chocolate bar. iPhone case, a uh, new cola wallet, which my friend actually just like forgot, like at my house a bunch of times, so I just, I guess I kept it. Uh, this, it was like, oh, I know what this is. It was for this case actually, right here. You just like put it on the back of your phone and then you can like play a bunch of preloaded games on it. But anyways, I got this when I was like crossing the border at one place and I was just like, it's pretty cool. So then I got that. And also I have these boys, don't know what they're called, but I knew at one point and I forget. I have the GTA 5 map. I have this guy. He's like a Native American, like, oh, I've read the origin story, but just type in Native American flute singer or whatever, flute player, sorry. And then I got all this stuff from PAX, well, most of it, not the clarinet and stuff, but Pac-Man, Pokemon Ball, and and one of Ross and things, uh, Assassin's Creed stuff. And yeah, it, it's pretty dope. Although, no, some stuff falls, especially when I'm playing VR and I like punch a wall or something, then it like rattles it. Old house. Uh, my sister made this a while ago. Don't know why I had that like 10 years ago. Uh, that is the Red Dead Redemption map up there. And here is my meth lab. And there's a hat from Seb, if you guys watch the live stream of Cuphead. Another one comes here actually tonight after I do this and make some thumbnails and stuff. So stay tuned for that. Actually, you guys have probably already watched it. So the next one or maybe the final one will come out after this video or maybe on the same day. Oh no. But anyways, here is a Blu-ray or disk drive or computer. I don't know why I have that sitting out there. There's a mug. That back from my sister's mug and it says yeet on it and i had some tea in it and then down here i have an led strip i just have in a white right now usually i have on like fucking like weird ass colors but i thought the white looked pretty nice and then right here really really handy magnetic tip screwdriver and shit and PS4 Slim with a 2 terabyte hard drive, some money, which I forgot to put away. But I also have a TV here. It's like, it's just like 720p one. It, it's like super cheap. And then I was like, you know what? I might as well like just put a Wii down there and shit. And also here is a VR headset. Uh, fuck. Uh, HTC Vive. Oh, what? I forget what it's called. But there's spider webs on it. I haven't used it for a while. Over here, a bunch of tacks for like shit outside of my door. 
and then a globe from the dollar store because I was like, you know what, that, that's pretty cool. Lots of people have cool gloves on their desk. Like, you always see those movies, and there's all just those, like, smart people that have, like, a glove on their desk. I was like, dude, I'm going to be smart now. Um, what else? Arctis 7 gaming headphones. They're really nice. And you guys can use my Amazon affiliate link in the description to make me some money. And it won't charge you guys anything extra if you want to buy that off of Amazon. So, yeah. Uh, also... Mamba wireless mouse, same thing with the headphones, buy it off of Amazon and use my link in the description. Same with this keyboard. And I got the headset mouse and keyboard for Christmas and it's so nice. I just wanted to get like a really, really nice one that'll last me like five years. Cause my other one, I think I sold it. And it was just like, it came with this mouse pad and like headset that I used to use for the longest time and mouse keyboard but in total like all that shit was like $60 Canadian which is like 45 American and it was not that good I mean for the price it was really good but VR cameras right there and right there and you guys can see that it's hard to aim when I can't just turn the camera around it's stupid here is a microphone link to the description use my link to Amazon to buy it and then a Logitech c920 camera 1080p and i think like it doesn't really do 1080p 60 frames but i think it says it does but anyways dual monitor i got this big monitor for 200 dollars canadian and like 170 american and it's not the best resolution or anything i think like five millisecond response time but it was just 200 dollars i wanted dual monitors especially for like streaming have the game on this monitor, which my friend gave me for free because his dad works for like IT or whatever. And then I got this monitor for like everything else. And it's super nice to have an ultra wide one. And then I have a stereo system, which I got a few years ago. Where I don't know what I'm pointing at. And also this painting or this picture of the Eiffel Tower. I've never been there but it just looks cool here is my futon if you guys are following me on twitter or instagram i forget which one i think twitter yeah twitter then which is linked in the description and on my channel banner then you guys would know that it broke and i fixed it i know such a handy man and then here i keep like all my like pencils and shit here i have uh an extra ps4 two extra ps4 remotes here bunch of papers and then in here i have on all just this is the thing of screws and stuff and then wire cutters just all that shit over here ah oh, this is really annoying to open and close it's a bunch of like computer parts and stuff like just sata cables down here and stuff but it doesn't close on its own so i have to put a piece of paper into it and then close it down. But main fridge, which currently has a red bull in it, and I don't have it on because it hums and it's kind of loud. Just like one of my fans on my computer, it's so loud. Here is some snap up hats, uh, Axe Can Apollo. I didn't even know that I had this. Please sponsor me. Monitor, which I tried to sell for like 10 bucks, but no one wants it because it's shitty VGA. Uh, I don't know why the desk is here, but it is. And also, I see you guys looking at this. Uh, it's already used. But anyways, yeah. And then I have some Spider-Man things back here. They're like collector editions, and they're like never opened and shit. Posters, posters, light. Look at that premium light job up there. And then I'll take you guys down low to underneath my futon. I have a bunch of like Wii games and stuff. And also a poker set, and that is like a poker mat. So it's kind of like a really cheap poker table. You just put it like, just unfold it onto like a regular table. Oh, I feel like I'm a car mechanic. So we have big boy speaker, but it's sometimes really shit. And then we have a computer. This is the brains of the YouTube channel. So up here, this is for the Arctis 7 uh, headphones, Bluetooth stuff. So I wanted a Bluetooth headset 
that like rt7 has like 48 hours battery life so it, it, it's pretty good it's pretty good i'm just unscrewing this right now and um don't get mad at me for the cable management this case is not that good for cable management i will fight anyone who thinks that it's good for cable management okay and then i have like 256 ssd kingston drive 500 gigabyte western digital just for like game videos and stuff although it got corrupted and that's why i lost so much data and stuff so that that sucks and then i have a four terabyte fucking monster masoon uh in hdd and that's where i keep basically everything because this 500 gigabyte drive kind of fucked me in the ass and then i am upgrading my computer first i want to do this room tour after i upgraded my computer but I, I think parts haven't shipped yet. It's been like a week from Canada Computers. But GTS 1070 Ti uh, FTW2 edition and 750 watt thermal take uh, power supply, Corsair liquid cooled uh, CPU, which I don't know why I got it other than the fact that it looks cool. Don't tell me that it doesn't look sick. I, I mean, it didn't really focus in this camera. But it looks sick. Although I can't even over quad my CPU. Uh, this fan is so goddamn loud. I'm not gonna unplug it because the wire is like behind the GPU and everything. But this RAM is eight gigabytes of DDR3. For any computer people out there, I'm upgrading soon. The parts are shipping. Okay, don't get mad at me. And it's like 1800 megahertz or whatever, which is slow as fuck and then we have my elgato cap game capture which i record almost everything on except for my live streams to youtube on and that's basically it i have a blu-ray drive or whatever in here and yeah I think that's the room tour complete 2021 edition, 1000 subs edition, whatever edition you want to call it, okay? Top comment gets to decide the name of it. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, thank you all for watching and snooping through my room, all you weirdos. Joking. I love you all. And bye. Also, I'm not trying to flex on anyone or show off anything or like just do anything with that type of thing so if you felt that way i'm sorry yeah bye